Alright, hey, how's it going, YouTubers? I got a good question from uh, one of my friends on the YouTube channel here, uh, from Spider-Man Fan for Life 12. He commented on, um, I think it was one of my Amazing Spider-Man uh, collection video, um, and he mentioned, you know, I got the same comics as you, but why do your comics take up the whole um, bag? And you know his, I guess, might flop around or something. So I wanted to talk to you guys today quickly about um, comic book storage. Okay, come here. And I'm trying to get my cat to leave the camera alone. <clears throat> uh, quickly, just to tell you guys what I use. Um, this size here. This is from Ultra Pro uh, Comic Book Supplies, which I find is the best. Maybe why yours is flopping around is because you have a, what I think is a, um, I don't know what's the word for it, not as good quality um, book. In this one you can see, these are both modern, okay? First of all, make sure you get, um, if you're looking for your bags, make sure it says modern or current sized bags. Um, but here I got two different brands. I have, like you say, the Hulk one is Ultra Pro. Uh, the Turtles one is um, uh, Comic Defense, which I don't like. I still got tons of bags hanging around. I don't like using them. Um, this the size for the Ultra Pro is six and three quarter inches wide, whereas the um, Comic Defense bag is about seven inches or just slightly over seven inches. And if you can see, I don't know in the difference here much. I mean, uh, but there is some difference there, right? The Ultra Pro holds it very nice and tight on the corners here. You can see it's almost a finger width I can get on the side here, or a thumbnail. Okay, so in this one, like I say, comic books, they flop all around. Don't like it. Ultra Pro bad. Go with this one. Best comic book storage if you want your books nice and flat and tight in there. Take up the whole space. Ultra Pro. Um, yeah, so... If you guys are go to your comic book uh, store, ask them if they can order Ultra Pro for if you want, or look at another comic book shop and see if they have one, or or even go in your shop and measure them. Like I say, six and three quarters wide. Those are the best ones. I have tons of books. As soon as I found out the perfect size, I got lots. Uh, talk about other stores. Oh, as well. Wait, wait. So Ultra Pro is good. Ultra Pro is good. You said Ultra Pro is bad. Did I? And then you said good. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. Yeah, my wife's correcting me. Ultra Pro good, Comic Defense for the bags, for current size bags are bad. <laughs> uh, just to show you as well, this uh, uh, piece of cardboard here, right there, this is an Ultra Pro silver sized. Okay? And if you look here, a silver side backboard is just as wide as there is Ultra Pro's or uh, Comic Defense's current bag. Okay? So that's not good. To, to be able to fit a um, silver sized backboard into a current sized bag, no, it's, I think it's just wrong. Not good measuring. Ultra Pro, best stuff. Talk a little bit more about some storage. Uh, you guys might have seen these ones on some of my shows, these hard cases. Right now these just um, fit current sized comic books. Got this one from Wizard World, or no, WizardUniverse.com. Um, the people who bring you the Wizard um, com comic magazine. On their website they have these, they kind of, some of them are out of stock right now and at one time I did see, these are called the Mill Case um, or Millennium Case, um, current or modern sized case. At one time they did have uh, called a Mill Case G which fits uh, bronze, bronze aged books and I'm really looking forward to them but really kind of going out not many sales kind of hard to find right now I only got about 25 of these hard covers in my collection I like them for some of your you know some of the comic books you really want to keep um, in storage but you don't really got the money to go to CGC right now or you want to show them around or take them to shows this is a good um, case to get um, so if anybody else knows any other um, um, comic book storage or bags that they use. What's your brand? Leave a comment. Talk about that. Uh, but I will say one thing good for uh, comic defense. The boxes. This is what I, I use. I use the 
modern sized boxes, short box, they got short and long. So, comic defense, the boxes are fine, but I just don't like their bags. But, so if you're picky about um, your comic book stores like me, definitely shop around. You guys can find something great, or you say, ask your dealer. Um, I think that's about it. Like I say, mention what you guys use, if there's anything better, or, yeah, or go check out wizard, uh, wizarduniverse.com. So, I, like I say, I thought that was a really good question, so I had to mention about that. Uh, quickly, just to mention to you guys, too, I got two eBay auctions still on. Uh, the Link Reborn 1 at ebay.ca, a uh, Wolverine origin graphic novel, uh, which collects issues 1 through 6, and the Spider-Man uh, 583 Obama issue, and the, um, what was it, X-Force issue... 17, I think, it, X4 17, the bloody variant with um, uh, X23 on the cover. Um, so that's my show for today, you guys. I'm going to come back next week, uh, probably Wednesday or Thursday. I'm going to be picking up my comics, so I'll show you guys all those. And also, today or yesterday was a day where uh, Hulk Team Up number one came out. And if you guys know uh, this other channel on YouTube, uh, Comic Book Club. Go to them. Alex Zalba, he's the main host. He wrote a backup story in Hulk Team Up uh, number one, so support him, and I'm going to support him. I'm going to review his comic book next week, and he's already showed it on, on, on his show. So uh, check out their uh, um, channel as well, Comic Book Club, Alex Zalba, uh, big YouTube guys, they do comic book reviews. Alex wrote a Hulk comic book. So that's my show, you guys. See you guys later.